When dealing with expressions and solving equations, such as the quantity 3 raised to the 3 minus 4 divided by the quantity 18 plus 15 that involves several operations, there are a set of rules called the order of operations that let us know which operation to perform first. The order of operations are, number one, start with the innermost parentheses and work outwards. And one note to this, when dividing two expressions, such as the quantity 13 minus 5 divided by the quantity 15 plus 9, the numerator and denominator are treated as if they were enclosed in parentheses. And many times brackets are used in place of parentheses on the outsides of the inner parentheses to ease confusion. An example of this would be for the expression two times bracket the quantity in parentheses 5 plus 3 divided by 4 end bracket. The first operation is the inner parentheses of 5 plus 3, which equals 8. Now we have 2 times the quantity 8 divided by 4. The next operation is the outer bracket of 8 divided by 4, which equals 2. And we have 2 times 2, which equals 4. Rule number 2 is to next evaluate all powers in the expression meaning any terms with an exponent or raised to a power. As an example, 3 raised to the 3 times 2 raised to the 2. We first perform the exponent operations. 3 raised to the 3 equals 27, and 2 squared equals 4, which gives us 27 times 4, and that calculates to 108. Rule number 3 is to next multiply and or divide from left to right. As an example, 4 times 3 divided by 2 times 6. We go left to right. 4 times 3 equals 12, and we now have 12 divided by 2 times 6. Next is 12 divided by 2, which is 6, and now we have 6 times 6, which equals 36. And rule number 4 is to add and or subtract from left to right. As an example, 18 plus 6 minus 4 minus 7. We go left to right. 18 plus 6 equals 24, and we have 24 minus 4 minus 7. Next is 24 minus 4 which equals 20, and we have 20 minus 7, which equals 13. And here's a much more complex example for you, with the steps written out on the screen. And the key to solving problems like this is to take your time and write everything out, as it's easy to get confused on the more complex problems. All right, my friends, hopefully you got something out of this video. I do have sh sh more videos right there for you. Till next time, I am out of here.